Hello and welcome to another installation of Motivating Moments. I am Pastor Gary Bush. Come on in, sit a while. Let's talk about encouragement for your work week. Here in the month of April, we've been speaking from this theme, the challenge to follow. And we found that theme in the book of St. Matthew, chapter number 16 and verse number 24. And it reads, Then said Jesus unto his disciples, If any man will come after me, let him deny himself and take up his cross and follow me. And so Jesus has issued an invitation to us that includes a challenge. A challenge means that you got an invitation, but uh, it's a conflict. There's a contest that you've been invited to. And so as Jesus invites us to follow him, we're going to come into conflict with the enemy. But he said we can do it and overcome if we observe these three things. Number one, we have to deny ourselves our own will and let his will be done. Number two, we have to take up our cross. Jesus carried a cross for the plan of God and we have to carry a cross for the plan of God. And then certainly last but not least, we have to follow him and to follow him means to emulate what he did. Jesus said the works that I do, he said you're going to do them and greater works because I'm going to my father and while I'm with my father, I'll be able to help you do the works. And so doing what Jesus did entails obeying God and doing the father's will. We die daily to our own desires, to our own plans, and we take instead the plan of God. We pray like Jesus prayed, not as I will, but thy will be done. And so to follow Jesus means to do what he did. We want to obey God. We want to do his will. We want to spread the word and encourage the kingdom of God. We want to rescue men's, men's souls or be an instrument in rescuing men's souls from destruction. We can't do it all. Some plant, some water. But God gives the increase. So whether you're a planter or whether you are a person that waters, you are all in the plan of God. And as we follow Jesus, eventually we'll meet up with him and we'll spend eternity with him. So this week, let's follow Christ. Let's do the things that he would do. Let's say the things that he would say. And in so doing, let's glorify the name of our Heavenly Father, which is in heaven. As always, I'm Pastor Gary Bush. Have a wonderful week. I'll see you next week.